Hey y'all, welcome back. Today I am taking you through a complete sort of makeover of the cabin, homeschool room, she shed, office, multi-purpose structure. As many of you may well remember, last year I had my husband and my father build me this cabin from a kit. It turned out to be exponentially harder to put together than we were prepared for and took significantly longer than we had expected. However, the end result was magnifico. Beautiful, love it so much. There's been a few little hiccups along the way. We're actually finally getting air conditioning installed in here on Friday, my mini split air conditioning unit. I'm so excited because I am dripping already with sweat right now. That sounds gross. I'm hot, it's hot in here, I'm sweaty. So when the structure first went up, essentially I just used furniture for the most part that we had from our previous home. I threw some bookshelves in here. I did get a new table and desk, but for a lot of things it was just repurposed furniture. So it really didn't work for me. There was a lot of clutter everywhere. And I don't mind a little bit of clutter, but there hits a point with clutter where I cannot do it anymore. Too many things out in the open. One of the things I really, really wanted was sort of a library wall, if you will, or a wall of bookshelves. So I finally decided to grab some bookshelves, get this thing redone and more functional. That's what we're doing in today's video. I'm gonna take you guys through as I remove a lot of the old things, build the new things, and then organize and sort them. I wake up in the morning in this great blue state Golden fingers caress my face Slips through the window on a silky breeze A dreamer's life to plant some seeds
do I think I can do these things? Why do I think I can do these things all by myself? Why do I bite off more than I can chew? All the time. I stopped filming because honestly, putting together IKEA furniture is already a nightmare and why force you guys to be a part of that nightmare? So, <laughs> I got three bookshelves built and one, it's got the glass doors and drawers. And this is the last one with glass doors and drawers. However, I got it all put together and like, ugh, one of the little things isn't in the hole. One of the little things didn't go in the hole. And now it's, I basically, like last night it was about 10 o'clock and I was so tired. I've been building Ikea furniture for about seven hours. And I was like, I can't, I'm getting frustrated. I have a feeling that I'm gonna like rip this thing apart and like gorilla this thing and just be like, ah, and ruin it. So I had to like woosah myself and go inside and go to bed. So now the kids are happy because we're supposed to be doing school right now, but there's nowhere to do school because mom didn't finish this yesterday. So I'm out here this morning, I'm finishing this and then uh, we'll start, I don't know, I don't know. I'll probably take a break and do school and then start rearranging things, but I'm very excited. I love how it looks and I love that it's gonna bring my vision to life of having like a library wall along the back. That's basically what we want is the whole back wall to be like shelving, library shelving stuff. Anyways, let's do this. Let's try to fix this mistake. progress people we're making progress I'm out of breath this is not organized as you can tell I'm just kind of throwing things up there to get them out of the way so that I can keep sorting through all of this stuff whoo we're making our way downtown
progress has been made. I've moved things around. Now I have to tackle getting all this stuff put away and into the file cabinet, which I'm still trying to decide. I kind of want the file cabinet there with my printers on top so I can easily get to them. I could shift it down a little bit, but we'll see. Let me get this stuff sorted and organized, which is going to take me a bit of time. Uh, and, and then we'll see. We'll see where we're at, you know? We'll see how we're feeling. Now, like many other projects I do, of course, this is not like 100% finished. I still have more organization to do. Um, I still am on the hunt for some kind of a storage cabinet that can help me put away a lot of my gear stuff that's out. Certain like lighting things and stuff like that. I've got a lot of Cricut stuff that's really jammed into that cabinet, so I'd like to, um, to find a little bit better of a solution for that. And then of course, just ongoing organizing these shelves as I finally pull stuff out of storage and move homeschool stuff from inside to out here. I love it so much. I'm so, so happy. I'm so glad that I finally got this done. Wash me in the water. Cleanse me in the mercy of your love. I need a heavenly I'm just wandering on my own So I hit my knees And I'm crying now, please Oh Lord, won't you bring me back home? Yeah So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the makeover of my homeschool room, cabin, office, all the things. This is really a very multi-purpose space. Um, lots of things happen in here. Lots of different things happen in here. And I love it. I love it so much. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you again very soon. Bye.